Hi there, this is Kalyan Verma. In this video, I'm going to show you uh, some of the formatting techniques in um, Excelsius. When I say formatting, uh, I meant aligning and uh, adjusting the components on the canvas easily uh, without taking the hassle of uh, manually moving it pixel by pixel. As you can see here on my canvas, I have a variety of components which are not uh, pretty much aligned the way I want it to. Uh, however, you can use the formatting hot buttons on the top uh, of Excelsius. You have a toolbar here in order to arrange them pretty quickly. Uh, if I don't have that, I need to move it pixel by pixel to match uh, and align every component. In this case, for example, uh, I have a set of check boxes here which are not aligned vertically and not spaced evenly. In order to align them vertically, and space evenly, it only takes two clicks for me. Just select all the checkboxes, select the option which says space evenly down. You can do this by the hotkey here, or you can always go to format and go to space evenly and say down. Now everything is uh, spaced down evenly. I want to align them in center. So I just select center horizontally option here, or I can do it from the format uh, menu too. Let's use the hot button now. I click on center horizontally and there you go. Everything is lined up and spaced properly. If you want to reduce the space, uh, you can simply get the last checkbox to the top and now select everything, do the same thing. And now you have the checkboxes closer to each other compared to before. So this, is, this toolbar is very useful while aligning components on your canvas. Similarly, if I want to send something back or to front, you can always use, if you observe the, the rectangle component here is overlaying my line chart. So if I want to send it back, you can either right click on it and say send to back. Uh, send to back will send the rectangle component to the back of all the components, but send back will only send it by one, one component. So. For now, I want to send it back all the way, so I right click and say send to back, or you can select it and choose one of uh, the hotkeys on the top here. So I would say send to back, and it's gone. And I have the chart in the foreground. At the same time, you can also resize the components based on a reference component. For example, uh, my desired size of the chart is the top chart, the small chart, and I would like to make the bottom line chart the same as the top chart. I would uh, press and hold control key on my keyboard and select the second chart too. Make sure you select the uh, desired chart first and then select the chart which you want to change or the component which you want to change in the end. So press and hold down the control key, select the second chart in this case, and you can use any of these three components, uh, three hotkeys to either make it make them same width, height, or both. In my case, I want to make it both, so I just click make same size. And if you observe, it's not aligned properly, so I want to align them, so I would simply say center horizontally. You also have an option to align left, so in some cases you can you know, there might be a requirement where you need to align left or right or top or bottom. And there is an option which says align vertically. So I can always bring this here, select the desired uh, position in the size chart, select the chart which you want to change, and select this and it goes vertically, it gets aligned vertically. In our case, I'm going to do it horizontal. So select my first chart, second chart. Make sure you hold down the control key and align it. At the same time, I, it, it need not be a similar component, it can be a different component. So I want the label-based menu to be the same size of the chart. So first select the chart, press the control key, select the label-based menu, and make same size is not possible because label-based menu uh, width depends on the text size. So in this case, make same size is same as make same width. So I would select, doesn't matter if I select make same size, it's gonna make it same width. And if I want to align them vertically, simply click on 
I'm sorry, align them horizontally, simply click on center horizontally. There you go. So you can use either the hotkeys or the format menu to align and also uh, try to explore various options re related to Canvas, uh, which could save you a lot of time when uh, organizing your components on your Canvas. Thanks for watching.